Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm at my sister's new house today. My mom is about to make us dinner for iftar. She's gonna make lapata, my favorite Turkish dish. This is, I used to, I used, Ali, you wanted to say something? What is that? <laughs> He's geeking, what is that? I'm eating noodles. He's eating noodles, spicy noodles. We're still getting settled. It's not spicy, it's normal. Oh, it's normal? Okay, and then I'm proud of this, you guys. I got this, my sister, a housewarming gift, the basket and the blanket. But her house ate, you know, but it's a little messy. And I gave her my books so she can eat and decorate, you know what I'm saying? We get them ready. She got these chairs. This is her old dining room table, though, that she bought these new. That's Yusuf and Yasin. Maybe boxing. You don't want to mess with my uh, nephews because they'll knock you down. Right, Yasin? Show them, show them. Oh, you especially you don't want to see Yunus. He, Yunus will knock you guys oh, yeah. down. Right? Yeah. I, don't... Oh, he's <laughs> I don't know. He's probably doing stuff. So yeah, this is the backyard. The sun is shining bright like my future. You said, Ali, what you doing? <laughs> Ali is geeking. And then these are vegan tahin. I, wait, I'm showing the vlog stuff. These are vegan tahin gummies that we're gonna try later, right? Ali be acting a baji for the vlog. He's acting up, y'all. This is the oranges. Oh. Hold on, let me tag his eyes. <laughs> Ali is it. Oh, I have to run to Myers and I have to buy butter. And what else do you have to buy? Onion, I think. So I'm going to go do that. Catch you guys. No, you guys have strawberries in the old house, I feel like. Facts. And blueberries. I mean, y'all mama is paying for us, so I can buy whatever you guys want. Peaceful neighborhood. Okay, we are at Myers looking at fish. I used to have guppies, y'all. Look at the guppies. Poor fish. things. Dead My fish. camera is not focusing. Right yeah, we're not going to film a dead fish. Yes, we are. No, we're not. That's yes. rude. Like, what if you were dead and somebody filmed you? <laughs> oh, look at the stuff we got. My sister might kill me for this, but who cares? Let's, the fancy fish, we just looked at all the fish. I forgot to vlog while gro grocery shopping, you guys, but we're in the fish aisle. My childhood vibes, I used to have pets, you guys. These are beta fish, Yasin. Why are they $20? Poor fish, all I know is that poor fish. They're just sad life. Oh, shit. All right, here's no dinner. Shit. This is La Pata. It's the last thing. Hello, everyone. Today is a Sunday, and it is very cold here in Ohio, of course. And I am, of course, in my iconic coat and iconic hat. But anyways, I came to an outlet you guys because I need to buy a new pair of shoes. I will show you guys the condition of my shoes in a second. But um so I need to pair buy a pair of new shoes and I was like I guess today is the day. It is cold. I hate it but um here we are finally getting new shoes and I'm excited because my shoes are really bad. And this outlet is in Sunbury, Ohio or Sunbury, Ohio, which is like thirty miles out of downtown where I live. So it's kinda too far to my liking but whatever i'm excited to see how it's like you guys i actually had and i came to the outlet because it is cheaper version of what you would get at the actual store and um i guess it's like from the previous years which i don't care about the trend i just what i like is what i like i like it doesn't trends don't matter to me if i like something that's all that matters so what's funny is that i had an opposite um what, how do you say that like i i thought the outlets was complete opposite of what it is i thought outlets were like expensive but it's, in reality it's you get the cheaper version of what you would buy in the store like at a mall outlet not an outlet but like in the, in the mall or shopping centers so i'm excited to buy nike shoes for a less price hopefully than the retail price and i'm gonna buy two this time you guys i'm gonna buy one for the gym and one for daily wear so that way i don't wear one out uh really fast and just to keep that balance between the separation of gym and daily wear so that'll be very exciting and having no extra shoes uh yeah let's go see what this outlet is about and see what kind of shoes we're gonna cop today all right for reference here's my shoes yo 
like my soul was coming out i had super glued that but then this happened and i've been wearing it for like over a month like this it's time for upgrade y'all it's time i can't i can't do this anymore we but let's go here's what the outlet is bunch of stuff close to nike right there y'all i am in a line to shop at nike i'm in a line to shop at nike <laughs> My first time here and I have to wait in the line to shop at Nike's. What? <laughs> that looks not okay. I like these. Let's give these a shot. What are those for real? Alright, this looks really nice. Oh, I want to try that. You guys, clap your hands if you're dying. All right, so I came home from the store. effed up some commas. I don't know who told me I can go on a Nike shopping spree, you guys, but I did, okay? It was much needed. This is not a shopping spree. This is like practical, but there's also a treatment in there too, like a treat for yourself. Okay, so I ended up getting these pair for, you know what, I think I'm gonna like balance between the switching my shoes between the gym and daily wear so I don't have to like be like, oh, this is exactly for the gym and this is exactly for everyday wear. Like switch it up, right? So I got these, you guys. Um, they're like, they fit really good. Like they feel comfortable on the feet and so she mean and ying. So that's what it is. I gotta tell you guys the price because you know, what's the point if I don't? These were... Okay, these were $64.99, so about $65. Really nice, really comfortable. It's not like to like style and dress up in nice clothes, but it's just to you know, be comfortable, but also decent looking. And then we got the nicer version of like very athletic shoes. I really, I really like them, you guys. They're so dope. These are the most pricier ones. And these were, let's see, I think they were $140 or one, what were they? Oh, okay, I was lying. They're, they're 165. Well, they're, okay, I guess the original price was 165 and it had a $25 discount, so they were 140, so I was not lying. So these, was, did the other ones have a discount? I'm not gonna lie, okay. The other ones did also have a discount, which put them at $55? No, they didn't have a discount. I think the discount is something else that I'll tell you guys in a second. So that is that. 144 these really like them really proud of them they fit real nice and look really nice on the feet and then you guys one of the shoes that i always wanted was the uh, air max i think that's what it is i thought they were air forces but they're air max so these are the shoes these are just the classic nike shoes that i always wanted and i'm 26 now so i think it's about time i cop these you guys i had to I know I wanted this all my life because they're just so beautiful. I just, and you can match it and style it with anything. And I'm like, while I'm here, I might as well just get it because later in the spring and summer, I wanna, I'm gonna want these anyways and I wanna be able to style them and dress up. So I'm like, while I'm here, just grab it, close your eyes and grab it and go. They're so beautiful. And I didn't have to even think about how they're gonna look on the feet because they, they look good. So this is the shoe that looks good on anybody with any clothes, any style. Like, they're so beautiful. I'm literally crying right now. Like, okay, I finally got these. They're nice. I don't know what the original price is, but they didn't say it was a discount. So it, these were priced at 115, you guys. 115. Um, so I guess I'm assuming that's the original price. Ah, they're so nice. Yeah, this is, I'm geeking with this one. This is like in style and obviously not wear every day. Uh, so that, that brought my like total to like $343. However, I was like at, at the checkout, I was like, is there any way I can save some more money or whatever? He's like, the guy's like, you can sign up for the Nike app and whatever, and you can get a 15% off. So my $343 order became $292. So that's about over $50 that we saved. So why the heck not? Well, it says, it says you saved total $73. No, that's because with the other savings, right? Yeah, the, like the discount prices. So that's what's up. 
I'm happy you guys finally can throw the old shoes away and just, you know, walk in style a little bit, walk in freshness. Um, and then the next thing is get this haircut, beer cut. Today is so cold. And then hopefully the weather is nice. And then I want to get my car washed and then do a car tour. We're just elevating our life, upgrading our life, trying to live our best life and trying to make money moves, you guys, because you know what I'm saying? This is, it's tough out here, uh, but it's also, yeah, you're just gonna make things work. So I hope that helps you guys. So I guess the thing takeaway from here is if you go shop at a Nike, I don't know what the other stores are, uh, sign up for their online thing so you can get your 15% discount. That really is a game changer. And yeah, that's what's up. And I obviously, I, when I buy things, I like to always say the price of things. So if you ever wanted to, so you automatically know, I don't like to play guessing games with people. I don't like to say, oh, you guys, it's affordable. It's such a price on the budget. No, I don't. How do I know what's affordable for you or what's in your budget? Or, you know, that's I hate when uh, influencers and content creators say that, like, shut the hell up and tell me the price. So those are the prices uh, at the outlet, you guys. So. This was, I feel like I talked too much, but I just want to give you guys some information, you know? I'm vlogging my life, but I also want to be informative and helpful if I can be. So yeah, if you want to, Air Force is also there, 115. I don't know what it is in other states, but that's what's up. I'll catch up with you guys in the next part of this vlog. I, I think I'm not going to the gym. I'm not going to the gym and like, the new shoes. Hey, let's go. Cheese and eggs, boy. Ah. I came to Mikey's Late Night Slice to get, I ordered pizza because when I was one time picking it up from a truck version, like for Uber Eats, the girl asked me if I wanted a slice. I was like, I can't have one because like, if you cut like pepperoni pizza with that knife, then I can't have the slice and whatnot. So she just gave me this free pizza. So I got a whole box. I ordered it from here. And then that's gonna be my dinner. So let's go pick it up and see how it is. So I came to the Mikey's Late Night Slice on 4th Street. My, that pizza has probably been ready like 20 minutes ago. Dude. I got my pizza and came home. I did get caught off guard, you guys. Hold on, hold, I need to tell you guys something. So I asked like, what are your drink options? They're like, it's a cup and I was like, okay, cool. What I should have done is ask for the price, okay? So here's a big box pizza. Obviously, I had the free uh, free coupon, so I got it for free. I've never had Mikey's Late Night Slice, so I'm very excited. But if you if you were to get a um, a cheese box, it would be $29. They only have extra large and size, so it would be like $29. Ooh, that looks yummy. And um, they also sell it by a slice. And I think usually the slices are like five seventy five. And you can get sauces, the sauces are free. You guys, this. And when he was giving me the cup and I was being funny, I was like, oh, I can get the cup for free. Cause like, I'm like, it's not like a random cup. It's like quality, I guess. And he was like, yeah. And if you bring it back, you get a dollar off your drink. You guys, for this drink, I'm sorry if I'm tripping. I paid $6.49 for a cup of drink, $6. Okay, I'm sorry, what? Their slice of pizza is cheaper than the drink. Not trying to complain. And obviously I was like too embarrassed to even like, say anything so i just like went for it because i'm already getting like free 29 dollars pizza but you guys 6.49 for a drink i could have very easily come to my apartment spending machine again 20 ounce for like less than two dollars holy moly but like i was too embarrassed to be like oh that's expensive like i'm getting this for free so i was just like whatever but like let me know what you have what you would have done because i got like a bunch of napkins and plates so, got the straw, <laughs> y'all. I be tripping. I don't know if I'm tripping, you guys tripping, but what in the extreme price is going on? I'm so, whew. But, anyways, God bless their soul for making me a clean cutter, big free pizza. That's beautiful. About to try it for you guys and see what it tastes like after I wash my hands. All right, it might be cold because this pizza was ready and I was delivering. These are the slices, very soft. Okay. Okay. They ate, it's good pizza, you guys. I don't know what the spicy unicorn sauce is. Let's try it. Can you guys see? Spicy unicorn sauce. Okay, the pizza is good. Cause I always deliver from Mikey's Late Night Slice to people, but I've never tried it yet. Okay, this is good. 
spicy sauce. Ooh. Okay. God bless the soul of the girl who just gave me a free pizza pass. But $29 right here. All right, I'm gonna eat my dinner. I'll catch up with you guys later on the on the on. Oh, yeah. Oh, by the way, the beautiful clouds, if you guys wanna see, this is what they look like. Hello everyone, I'm finally gonna go get a haircut here at 2 p.m. and this is gonna wrap up this vlog. I was just, I've been trying to get a haircut, it just hasn't been working appointments wise and then it's like the weather is so cold here, it's un, unmotivating, but I wanna feel like a decent human being. I just can't even look at myself in the mirror. So we gonna go get this haircut, you guys, and feel a little good about ourselves. I just did some cleaning and then yeah, we'll go from there. I got my camera for uh, time lapse filming on my haircut. Of course, I can't miss this on a camera. You know what I'm saying? Hey, let's go get the stupid haircut. Alright, you guys, I got the haircut. You guys, I'm I'm so much confident now. Like I was like slacking. Now look at me. Talk about talent. He's so talented, you guys. Like, this is dope. I was like, who the heck is this? I feel so much better now. Like I'm happier, yo. It's possible to look good, okay? okay yes. And we're not all that, but we look just okay, just fine. Fine enough to jump in Bora Bora. Wee! All right, time to shower and stop geeking too much, y'all. <laughs> Jose is the best. I mean, look at that. All right, okay, time to shower. Peace.